Hi guys, Night here. How's everyone doing? Welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to show you how to fly in planes of Eidolon in free-to-play awesome Warframe. Yes, I've got finally unbanned because my account was hacked. Nothing serious happened. The DE support solved everything without any damage to my account whatsoever. So I started to play planes of Eidolon with a delay. And I was like, dude, you are not gonna be able to fly from the beginning. You know, I was used from the World of Warcraft that to get fly you have to grind at least one month. But this is not true in Warframe, not at all my friends. To get Archwing in Plains of Edalon, it's so easy, it's really so simple. Just follow my steps and you are good to go in a couple of hours. But first of all, if you are new to my channel, hit the subscribe button. It's for free and it helps me more than you know. Don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss the big 500 subscriber giveaway video. Let Leave me a comment and hit the like button. It takes only a second of your time. Okay, let's do this! Okay guys, so we are, to, we are going to build our archwing in planes of Eidalon. So first what you need to do, uh, you need to buy your Archwing segment. Uh, Archwing segment, see here, Archwing launcher segment. You have two choices. First is to buy it for a Platinum if you can, uh, or the second is to pick up it from Dojo. I will show you where. Uh, but it really helps if you got your resource booster. Uh, so just type booster into the shop and uh, it really helps if you have your 30 day or 3 day booster. Those boosters are quite expensive, but it really helps to get your resources for your Archwing as fast as possible. It basically doubles amount of resources you get from your farming, okay? So uh, as you see, Warframe is free to play. So if you can buy Platinum, it's not so expensive, especially if you got the discount. Uh, I encourage you to buy Platinum to uh, put some money into the games because the Warframe is free to play and the developers need to eat and feed their babies, you know? So it's really important, okay? So buy a resource booster if you can, if you not, not important, but it really helps, okay? So buy the Archwing segment from the shop or go to Dojo. I'm in a new clan because I was banned, you know, for because my account was hacked. So I'm new, uh, I'm in new clan starting in. Hi guys, how's everyone doing? And we are going to the Dojo. We're going to Dojo and we're going to our Tenno lab. Each, every... Every clan has a Tenno lab. I think it's this one. Yes, this one. So let's go. No, this is an energy lab. Okay, it's embarrassing. <laughs> How are you guys doing? I did not did not play Warframe for a long time, so I'm catching up with Planes of Eidolon. It's not <laughs> this one. I'm catching up with Planes of Eidolon. And we'll see. So let's go to the Tenno lab. And we're going to buy Archwing Launcher Segment Research. I'm going to replicate it because we need to see what we need, okay? So we're going to replicate it, okay? And we're going to leave Dojo. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna edit this part because I want you to see everything I do to, you know, without any, any, any jumps, without any jumps and cuts, what I do to get the archwing segment, okay? So we're going, we're going here. An archwing launcher segment, okay? We need iridite, 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 sorry, we need 50 iridite. I will show you how to get it. We need uh, Garagrul, and this is the basic, this is the basic um, resource you get while fighting and doing uh, doing bounties in the uh, in Plains of Eidolon. And you need Oxium, uh, everyone has to have like, uh, you know, million, a ton of this stuff. Okay, so, so uh, we get iridite, Garagrul, Grogdrul, Okay, an Oxium and build Archwing Launcher. I will show you how to get to those two resources in a moment. Okay, so we are going to build Archwing. I'm not going to build it because I've got it, okay? As soon as you as you build it, you install it and you have opportunity to build Archwing Launcher. So for Archwing Launcher, we have, again, we need Irradiate and we need Grogdrul. Grogdrul. Okay, Grogdrul and Fish Oil and Circuits. Now I will show you how to get fish oil, grog through circuits and irradiate. I will show you in a second. Okay? So, 
After you build your archwing, you just simply uh, go to your gear and just put it into the gear and you use it normally like you would do anything else. Okay, so let's go to the Plains of Eidalon, but don't go straight to Plains of Eidalon, go to Setus. Go to Setus and go to, go to Colm, doesn't matter, okay? Go to Colm. First thing you need to do when you go to Setus, uh, of course, uh, just, you know, explore a little bit, explore a little bit, and we're going to fast travel to the bounty guy, to the Konzu, okay? Okay, so we are at him. Go to bounties and do for do few bounties, do few of them, so you can get this nice reputation with him. Okay, do few bounties, like so, so to get like two thousand or three thousand bounty. If you done that, if you done that, you have like few bounties done. Go to fast travel again and go to the fisher, go to the fisher, browse wares, and buy the first lanzo fishing spear as soon as you are on the second second tier of your uh, of your reputation you can get the better spear it's not better it's just for different kind of ships but we will use only the basic one you don't need nothing else just for 500 standing by this by this one okay and optionally you can false travel to the mining gear and you can buy the the miner but we don't need miner for archery okay what we need we need only we need only uh, those few okay so we are going to fast travel back to the bounties and what you have to do now listen carefully really important select the highest difficulty bounty even if you are not geared it doesn't matter we are not going to do this bounty because resources and uh, select uh, Select, uh, I'm going to cancel it, select solo, okay? Select solo, first select solo, then go to bounties, and again, accept the highest difficulty bounty. Again, we are not going to complete this bounty. We are going to farm resources, because resources drop uh, uh, with the difficulty you have, okay? So higher difficulty, we drop more irradiate, okay? So we're just going to enter the planes of a dialogue. Okay, and we're going to look to left and going to look to right. If you are not geared, don't proceed too far because you will die. Okay, so just around this pool, walk around, walk around and check for those irradiate uh, nodes. Normally I would use my arch wing, but since I don't, um, since I since we are simulating that you don't have archwing, we're going to do it by food. Okay, so they are attacking me. Just, just, just forget them. Just, uh, just browse left and right around, just around the entrance. There should be a lot. We are not lucky. We are not lucky this time. If you are not lucky, just restart it. Okay. And uh, you know, look for those. Look for those irradiate nodes. Oh, here you see. So just pump it, and you will see as soon that I got six irradiate. At the highest difficulty, you can get six to ten irradiate per one node. On the lowest difficulty, you get only one. But this is with resource booster. So cut it with half if you don't have resource booster. Okay. So without resource booster, you get three to five. Okay. It shouldn't be so difficult. You, you may proceed further inside of the map if you want, but you are risking your ass to be kicked. If you are geared, if you are geared, there is no problem. Just farm the irradiate this way, okay? But this is the best way how to get irradiate. Don't forget, use the highest, highest bounty, use the highest bounty and go and search for it, okay? That's it, All right? And you can restart it by going back and uh, forth. So now we are going to, I'm going to show you how to get the fish oil, okay? The fish oil. There is, it is really simple. Am I going to, no, I'm not going to, I'm not going to lower the difficulty just for the purpose of the video. So just go out and go to the, to the left pool. There is a left pool. You may lower the difficulty of the bounty because our enemies here. 
Okay, if you if you if you cannot find them, okay. But if you can, just you know, just uh, here is another one. You see, here is another one. You radiate. Okay, clean this, or you don't have to clean it, and uh, jump on those rocks into the into the middle, into the middle of the. Uh, this is my best spot. And stay here. This is my best farm farming spot. Uh, I will do the fishing guide later, but we are we are going for the moment. We are going to get the we are going to get the fish oil. Okay. So what you can do, you may use your you may use your uh, lures and you may use your dice. Okay. So we are going to to equip our. Uh, our, our spear and now you can use your dice and you can use your baits okay dice are good for fishing in the evening okay so now you see the fish and just okay I'm, I'm terrible in this so just look for the fish it's a nice day and this is the best spot for me to get that fish oil okay we got the fish and the fish just fish a little fish half hour or Maybe, maybe longer, you know? So just fish for those fish. <laughs> here we go. As you see, this is a nice spot. A lot of fish is here. Here's a big one. Okay. So everything what we do is close to the entrance. So even if you are, even if you are low level, okay, you see how much you can fish in a, in just, in just few moments, just fish, okay, just fish, that's it. Okay, I'm going to cut this, I'm going to end this fishing session, because I don't think we need more fish to show you what to do, okay, and we are going to, we are going back, okay, back to the to the entrance so as you see everything we did so far can be done on master level one okay and as you see we got fishes and we got 32 year date now we're going to port to the we're going fast travel to the fisher we go in uh, fishing services select the fish and we're going to select all those fishes that's MC lurks yes Okay. Come on. Okay, so select all those fishes. And don't donate. You don't need. Just cut the bait. And as you see, you got plenty of fish oil, plenty of fish scales, and everything else. Okay? Select OK. We got our fish oil. Now we are going to just leave setters. We're going to back to our ship. So, we are going to our foundry. And now you see. Okay, so we're going to Archwing, okay? Archwing, okay, so Archwing same deck. We get Irradiate, I show you how. Select the highest bounty possible, uh, then go around the entrance area and farm Irradiate. Grogdrul, <laughs> Grogdrul you get from the bounties, from the fighting of the enemies, drops from the enemies. So just just fight, just fight enemies and they, they, they just drop it, okay? It's not so difficult to farm it. Do a few bounties and you are good to go. Uh, Oxium is basic, is basic uh, resource. If you don't know how to farm it, just find on a Google or on YouTube where. And as soon as you got built this, it takes 12 hours. And then we can buy, then we can build archwing launcher. You need 50 radiate, you need fish oil, as I showed you. You need 30 fish oil, you need these uh, grog drool circuits. Okay, I'm going to be build myself more of it it takes 30 minutes and then it, it's consumable and it just adds to your gear it just adds to your gear uh, as as shown here okay so i think this is that's it that's it it's really simple really simple guys as you see this is this is simpler than simple okay guys thank you for watching i hope this video was helpful for you if you are new to my channel hit the subscribe button it is for free and it helps me more than you know. 
Don't forget to hit the bell button so you don't miss the big 500 subscriber giveaway video. Leave me a comment and hit the like button, it takes only a second of your time. And thanks again for watching guys, and as always, have a good one, bye bye. Truth will break your chains, we have the key Open your eyes and see Everything